Hello everyone, it's DA here, hope you guys are doing great, hope you are doing amazing. As most of you know, the sacrifice quest is around the corner, and so it marks the conclusion of an amazing cinematic trilogy. The second dream, the war within, and the sacrifice. So what is next for Warframe? And that's what I'm going to be talking about today. Because as most of you know, the cinematic universe, the cinematic experience, is one of the main reasons that we come back to Warframe, or one of the main reasons why we enjoy Warframe. It is what brings us together, and that is a rich lore that a lot of us enjoy. Now, if I am someone who works at DE, what are we supposed to do about the next trilogy once we are concluding with Sacrifice? I believe that the next trilogy should be an origin story for the Tenos. Time and time again, you can use the Marvel Cinematic Universe as an example. While some heroes might have been introduced with an origin story, they all had that cameo or teaser within another movie. Look at Thor, look at Black Panther, look at Spider-Man, and you can even look at the upcoming Captain Marvel. At the point that Warframe is in right now, an origin story will be a perfect thing. Something dealing with the life before the second dream, the next trilogy will be amazing because the first part could be the very beginning since we will be finding out about the Warframes in the Sacrifice Quest. Episode 1 of the new trilogy could be the Tenos learning about different abilities, different things about the Focus Tree and the Focus Schools. This could further expand the story as DE will tell the story of one of the Tenos, not all of them, maybe Yuvan, Rel, whoever it is. And from that part, you will be able to unlock new abilities and rediscover skills that had been lost because of that second dream. Second part of the trilogy, in my opinion, is that this is where I think they need to introduce the war against the sentients using the Tenno. This will be our time to discover what hells we can use the Warframes for, we can fight alongside the Dax soldiers, imagine launching the Warframe from orbit and you transferring into it in the middle of an epic landing. That would be an amazing view and a crazy thing to watch. Now this could also lead to more information about another focus school or another focus tree that we don't know about or ranks and abilities that will basically supercharge your Warframe. The comics already showed us that the Orokin could implant memories and abilities into people, so the possibilities are out there and they are endless in Warframe. Now the third of that trilogy, and the final part of that trilogy, basically should be the Orokin versus the Tenno. Have a rich storyline and build up events leading up to the slaughter, have a choice to either join the fight or stay away from that slaughter. DE could definitely use this to tell the story of maybe how Ateno will end up being one of Stalker's acolytes, or Ateno being a rogue in the eyes of their other Tenos. Now this is not perfect, but I think this will be a great way. And this will be an amazing way to start the next trilogy within the Warframe Cinematic Universe. Let me know what you guys think out there down below in the comment section. And also if you have to decide what will be the next trilogy within Warframe, let me know what you think it should be as well. Thanks for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one.